Anime hot take, man. Attack on Titan is mid. So Yeah, that's the type of stuff you're going to be seeing because we're looking at the worst anime hot takes of all time. What is your anime hot take? Saitama beats Goku. Now this take in particular isn't exactly the worst take, but it is a pretty bad take. From what we've seen so far, Saitama's best feat was when he destroyed a bunch of stars that were far away when colliding with Garo's attack. And this feat would roughly scale to run multi-source system level at the highest. Goku on the other hand in his Super Saiyan Red form while clashing with Beerus was outputting enough energy to shake the whole universe. And Super Saiyan God is far from his strongest form. Let's see what's next. Okay then, we have some Naruto vs One Piece matchups. First matchup is Prime Sasuke vs Current Manga Law. As much as people aren't gonna want to hear this, Law blitzes and beats the shit out of Prime Sasuke. Not only is Law in the manga able to fight against a character like Hybrid Kaido, Law is also able to react to attacks from Kaido multiple times. Kaido's the same character that blitzed to Gear 4 Luffy earlier on in the series. Luffy is the same character you can get to massively faster than light and- Okay, so at the end there, he said Luffy is massively faster than light, and for those of you that don't know how crazy that is, massively faster than light is 100 to 1000 times the speed of light. Realistically, loss speed would be FTL to a few times FTL at most. And this is scaling him off Kizaru, who's known for being one of the fastest in the verse. He has consistent statements saying that he's light speed, not faster, and I'm not saying he isn't faster, but it's just not saying he's faster, he is the speed of light. So realistically, loss should be somewhat relative to Kizaru in terms of speed. Sasuke on a low ball should be at least multiple times the speed of light because early Shippuden Naruto was performing FTL level feats. And in the war arc, he gets even faster and even more so in the last movie. And by the time he's an adult, he should be at least multiple times the speed of light. So Sasuke indeed does not get blitzed. I would actually say he wins with a rather low difficulty considering his insane AP and hacks. And since the video is short, I'll add my own personal takes. This first take might be equally as controversial as the second one, but I believe that Barto is the best new gen. Now I know I said this one may be equally as controversial, but it may be even more controversial. And it's definitely gonna start a war in the comments. Personally, I believe that Bleach is the worst in the big three. And one of the main reasons being is that it has one of the worst arcs in anime history, which is the Bount arc. And other than that, I don't really have anything bad to say about Bleach, but it just doesn't compare in terms of like the emotional impact as Naruto and One Piece. This was a little bit of a different video, but let me know if you guys want to see more and make sure to drop a like and subscribe and I'm out. Peace.